right so come with me as i take myself on a solo brunch day yes so i took myself to boku for their cherry blossom brunch now let me be completely transparent <laughs> um this was back in march yes march mm -hmm. but i was like i'm cleaning out my drafts and i don't want to scratch this footage so here we are posting it today yay <laughs> so yeah so i had to start things off with a drink i had their featured drink at the time which was the blooming dragon it had lychee vodka elderberry dragon fruit ginger syrup and lemon juice and when i tell you that thing was delish mm -hmm. yes delish okay now this was my first time at boku and i was like what better way to break it in than a brunch so, right included in the ticket was a sake bomb and this is pretty much my first time doing this so yeah mm -hmm. here we go and you're going to take it to the face. <laughs> All right? And okay, that's what I do my three, two, one, stop me about. We'll all get out together and we'll do it. Then um, we're going to get back to the music and go to the brunch. And probably another half hour. Then after that, then after that, I have a song. We're going to hear that song. Prepare. My staff is going to come around with some green teas. All right, so we're all set for the sake bombs. I want to drop it. I want to just get it up. Wow, we got, we got a phone over here. All right, we ready? So that was that. Uh, I'm not really a fan of beer, but I was just like, <laughs> it's here. I'm here. Let's do it. Okay. Yeah. So for food, however, I did have their sticky wings, which I enjoyed. And I had their shrimp and scallop wontons, which was my favorite. Okay. The girl sitting next to me had this rice. I said, oh, I like what I see. Let me order. So that was the fat scallop rice. Um, it was okay. It wasn't my favorite. But when I tell you the DJ. <laughs> The DJ was DJ in, okay? I met him later on and his name is DJ Angel. And yeah, I mean I tell you, I barely was able to eat my food because he kept playing back to back to back. Yes. And oh my gosh, yes. So I definitely ordered me a second drink. And it was called the Pink Blossom. I saw the bartender making one. I was like, ooh, make me one, make me one. And then after that, I definitely posted up in these people establishment to take some video and pictures. And here's my outfit. Yes. That's the end of my brunch day. And yeah, if you enjoy, please go ahead and follow and like for more. symphony just to say how much you mean to me what would you do if i told you you were beautiful would you Prepare, my dad's gonna come around with some green teas. 
If you want it, you're going to sit back like this, and we're going to start pouring. And when you're done, just let my staff know by doing this. And we'll stop pouring, okay? All right, so are we all set for the sake bombs? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I want to drop it. I want to drop it. Oh, we got a fun over here. All right, are you ready? Three, two, one. Welcome to another vlog. If you're new here, I am Pebbles. <sighs> Whether you're new or returning, thank you so much. Either way, yeah. So um, I just left brunch at Boku. It was such a good time. 
it was a cherry blossom theme brunch i found it on i think like facebook or something like that it was advertising it and i was like oh that's not like a good time and everything so i'm sorry i'm really stuffed and yeah <laughs> So yeah, I had such a good time. I was solo, so I guess you could say it was like a solo brunch date or whatever. Ooh, I'm stuck, like for real. Bumpy. <laughs> so yes, yeah, so I'm about to go home now and change clothes and figure out what I'm gonna do for the rest of the day. I, was, I had planned on going to work, but I don't know. The way I'm feeling is just like that. Uh. So the sticky wings was cool. The sauce on it was good, but the wings itself, it was a little under seasoned for me and a little overcooked, like fried a little too hard, I guess. But the wontons was delicious. The rice was okay. It had like a sweet taste to it that I wasn't expecting. But other than it was cool. Um, the two drinks was cool. Um, and then I had like three shots of sake. One in that bomb. And then one because I just wanted to taste it. And then the bartender handed me another one. So yeah. So um, I had a good bit of stuff. And so yeah. The DJ was amazing. Um, he played a, a variety. He played a. <laughs> he played a variety of music. Um. And yeah, it was such a good time. Um, I didn't really know what I was walking into type of thing because that was my first time being there, period. So I had like no idea like how it was set up or anything like that, but I had a great time. And so yeah, so that's how I started my Saturday. Um, last night I was trying to figure out outfits. And so I was up until like five o'clock in the morning because I had to like wash my hair and um yeah i didn't even, um do my hair i just put the wig on i was like i don't feel like doing my hair so it worked out or whatever i came up with the outfit and i was like oh i like this unexpectedly and so yeah here we are oh my god happy saturday so yeah so that's that i'm done for today i don't have anything else planned i might do something with venice i might be lying but tomorrow we have another brunch. So yeah, so I just wanted to say hello. Introduce the vlog. And yeah, I'll see you later. <laughs> hey you, all right, so you remember Kathy, right? Yay. All right, so she invited me to her brunch. She has a social group based out of Charleston, South Carolina. So that is where we are headed to. And yeah, so the theme for this brunch was to come as someone famous, a woman that you look up to, being that this was back in March during Women's History Month. So yeah, here's how it went. Um, I got fried this So I am a speech therapist. So today I am the first black speech therapist, Kelly Quinn Brown. Okay. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> and today I dressed up as Madam CJ Walker. She was the first black woman to produce products for black women's hair. And she was also the first um, self-made millionaire woman in America. Wow. Hi, I'm Morgan and I am Tabitha Brown. She's a motivator speaker. <laughs> And Tracy is from Girlfriends, y'all, and my favorite show. Hey, happy Sunday. Okay, so just left the brunch. It was such a cool, vibey type of event. Um, it was cold and windy because we was outside and whatever. Um, but it warmed up now. Of course, it warms up as soon as we leave. But yeah, so it was cool. It was good to see Kat. And, you know, she um, has this social group that she started and I came to support. Um, and she's been doing it for a few months now. And it's my first time attending. It was pretty cool. Um, so, yeah, so now I'm about to change and then go to the beach because I've been wanting to go to the beach. And it's such a nice day and I want to take advantage of my time here. So, yeah, that's what I'm about to do. I just wanted to say hello. Um, yeah, so... I came as Tracy Ellis Ross. Um, here's the, um, excuse me, <laughs> here's the um, reference picture. I just Googled like some of her outfits and just like um, see what I could pull from my closet or my wardrobe, I should say. And so, yeah, and then here's my picture. And yeah, the two of them side to side. I mean, yeah, so that's that. Well, I'm hot. Um, <laughs> I'm really sweating glistening right so yeah the, so yeah so I'm about to go change like I said and then head to the beach I bought some clothes um yeah I don't know what I'm about to put on I bought a skirt and a pair of pants so yeah yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right yeah pretty tired i don't know if it's because it was just raining today 
or I did too much yesterday because I was cleaning out the shed in the backyard. And yeah, I don't know if it was a combination of the two or just the rain because I'm not like physically, like my body isn't tired. It's just like all in my face and like just tired. Like, you know, so yeah, definitely didn't have a productive day. <laughs> but you know, yeah. So that's that and I'll see you at the event. <laughs> my battery is not fully charged. So let's see how much footage I can get. If not, I'll be getting it on my phone. All right, yeah. <laughs> hey you. All right, so come with me as we go to the grand opening of a new event slash co-working space called the Libra Creative Hub. <laughs> such a vibe at this event i enjoyed myself so much they had food which i missed because i was a little late and yeah it was such a good event i saw some familiar faces networking you know just vibing out i honestly didn't want to leave but that was a downstairs area where um the party was really going on and here we are upstairs in the more intimate area so they have a patio and they also have this event slash co-working space out here, which is like the main space. And in the back, there are different offices that you can, I believe you can rent them out. I don't really know all the details, but I'll definitely have all the information in the caption. Two offices, which is what I'm showing you right now. And I believe there's a third, but I'm not exactly sure because the door was closed. <laughs> <laughs> of course it's not an event unless bella and i are in the bathroom cutting up but yes they had these beautiful mocktail drinks that was so cute i enjoyed it really 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 they had a dj oh my gosh and that is the owner hey teddy is <laughs> he looks so good yes yeah, so i had me a mocktail and i just thought it was just the cutest thing ever and oh yeah by the way this is my outfit yes so i hope you enjoyed if you want to know any detail about my outfit that will be in the caption as well and yeah